Director Ray. Last year, you might recall, sir, our exchange regarding the FBI's involvement on January 6th and prior. I'm happy to jog your memory to quote, according to the record, I ask you, did you have confidential human sources dressed as Trump supporters positioned inside the Capitol on January 6th prior to the doors being opened? You responded, I quote, again, I have to be very careful of what I say. To which I said, it should be a no. Can you not tell the American people no? We did not have confidential human sources dressed as Trump supporters positioned inside the Capitol on January 6th. A year has passed. We sit here again a year later. We the people still do not have a definitive answer from you or anyone else in the Biden administration regarding the FBI presence and participation in the months leading up to the November election, and in the weeks and days prior to January 6th, and on January 6th here in D.C. We can't get a straight answer, it, although we have a tremendous amount of evidence harvested and reviewed over the course of the last year, which you will see in September, Stephen D'Artano, formerly in charge of the FBI's field office in Washington, D.C., testified to the House Judiciary Committee that he was aware the FBI informants would attend the Stop the Steal rally thrown on January 6th. You confirmed that the FBI had confidential human sources at the Stop the Steal rally on January 6th here in D.C., sir? Congressman, as we've discussed before, I'm not going to get into where we have or have not used confidential human sources. But what okay, I can we'll tell move you, on. you asked for a definitive answer. We'll move answer. on. It's my time. You said no. You're not going to answer. That's cool. We're watching. Mr. Chairman, may you're, I answer the question? Your moment, your moment will come. This is my time. Earlier this year, an FBI informant who is reported to have, quote, his quote, under oath, marched to the U.S. Capitol with fellow Proud Boys members on January the 6th, close quote. He said he was communicating with his FBI handler while people were entering the U.S. Capitol. Can you confirm that the FBI had that sort of engagement with your own agents embedded within to the crowd on January 6th? If you are asking whether the violence at the Capitol on January 6th was part of some operation orchestrated by FBI sources and or agents, the answer is emphatically You're saying not. no? No. You're saying no? Not okay. violence orchestrated Let's by FBI on. sources or agents. Are you familiar with, with, you know what a ghost vehicle is? Director, director of the FBI certainly should. You know what a ghost bus is? A ghost bus? Ghost bus. I'm not sure I've used that term before. Okay. Well, it's pretty common in, in law enforcement. It's a, it's a vehicle that's, that's used for secret purposes. It's painted over. These two buses in the middle here, they were the first to arrive at Union Station on January 6th. 0500. I have all this evidence. I'm showing you a tip of this iceberg. Mr. Chairman. These two buses Mr. are Chairman. painted completely white. Point of order. Point of order. Sure. Just run over the time. I understand, but you'll recall that Ms. Jackson Lee's been allowed to go two minutes before. I've been very fair in letting people finish their questioning throughout my tenure as chairman, and I'll continue to be fair on that regard. But I will make a note to the members, if you could stay as close within your time as possible, we have a lot of people that want to ask these gentlemen questions. So with that, the gentleman yields. But uh, your, your point, I've been very fair in this, Mr. Ivey, uh, with I, everybody I, I, on this side of the aisle just as much. I don't think I accuse you of being unfair, Mr. Okay. Chairman. I, you're you're making a point. Order. Okay, thank you. Uh, I now recognize, now recognize Mr. May Gray. I close this, this statement, uh, Mr. Mr. No, Mr. Chairman? No, I, I, think, I think your time is expired, Mr. I note that, that other members across the aisle have been, been granted time, and I object well, to, my, to my question being, well, being closed. This is a very significant hearing, Mr. Chairman, and these buses are nefarious in nature and were filled with FBI informants dressed as Trump supporters you, and you, deployed onto our Capitol on January 6th. Your day is coming, Mr. Ray. Mr. 
uh, Higgins. 